Just waiting on your camera. There All we go. All right. We're, we're alive. Dude, I am so freaking excited. We're excited, man. <laughs> we're very excited. It's good. It's a good thing. Let me move that thing. That looks awful. See, that's what happens when you go live. Yeah, it's live. Yeah. It's live. All, All right, right, so, so look. Um, what's the announcement today? Dude, this is a huge announcement. So look. We have been working on uh, on just providing next level service to our clients, and we are launching something that is just freaking enormous. And it is our uh, concierge service, right? That's right. And look, l l let's think about how this happens, right? A person buys a house; they are handed the largest asset of their life with no freaking information on how to manage and maintain it. Worse, the okay. largest debt of their life. Right. Then we strap them with hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of debt and give them. No way to not only debt, debt plus wealth, right? 87% of the average retired American's wealth is in their home, right? So we dump this asset and debt on their life with, and and what does a normal lender do? They send the recipe, recipes are important. Yes, really, a very really nice. nice recipe on Thanksgiving. Yes. A uh, text message on their birthday. I was say, birthday texts are big, and uh, oh, when the rates are out, they just say, Hey, can I get paid again? Hey, I'd like another paycheck, right? What, what, a, what, a, what a well, that sucks. What a shitty way to do that. So we're not going to do that, and that's what the concierge service I mean, is about. No, we're still going to do that. Right, right. But in addition <laughs> to that, um, I'm not saying the recipes. But um, recipes. in addition to that, we're going to help people uh, move. We're going to help them manage their asset, and we're going to help them manage their debt. So, look, let me start on the moving piece of it, okay? We are providing clients with an app where they can, with a couple of clicks, uh, connect all their utilities Okay, search through what's out there as far as what internet providers, what specials are being run at the time. What discounts, all yeah, that. Yeah, all that stuff. Um, and we're going to help them update their addresses. Right. So you could literally put in all of your banks, all of your different companies that you deal with, and in one button, update your addresses with all of them. And, and let, me, let me say that this service is free for all of our clients. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. And, uh, and by the way, also um, discounts on moving, movers, discounts on boxes. You could have packing lists and moving lists. I mean, everything to help you manage what happens after closing. The first, part, first thing that happens is the move. Which is a stressful part. It's a stressful it part of buying a house is the move. So, yeah. so we're trying to make it as easy as possible. Absolutely. Right? And just a one-stop thing where you can make a couple clicks and get everything set up. Now, the second portion is the one that I think is the most exciting about it, at least for me. Because, you know, as I share in the classes I teach and all that, I'm not a very handy guy. No, when you it comes suck. To, you know, you suck. it's funny because um, I always say this. My wife it comes from a family where, you know, it's like the American family where something breaks, they fix it and they never call so anybody. People don't fix this. their people don't fix their own homes outside no, of America. No, no. <laughs> yeah, that's, super, like, that, that's like prideful here. Like it, that it means is. something it more is. than just yes. your handy. So she's like that. And I always joke that since the very beginning, right? I'm like, hey, I live in condos my whole life. Like I don't fix anything. I don't know. Like when the car breaks or something, I look at her and I'm like, so you know something or do I have to pay? <laughs> and look, and, 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 but the thing is I married her and she thought that the next day I would just be wake handy. up and be handy. And this hasn't been the case as, yeah. you know, as history has shown. And, and it's an extremely stressful thing for me to buy a house that I don't know how to maintain. Yeah. And, and the, here's the thing. Going beyond knowing how to maintain it, the question becomes, do you know when you should maintain it? Yeah, well, I just had to pay, you know, a good amount of money because I, I wasn't doing the required maintenance for my AC. Exactly. And, and I, have, I have a neighbor that just dropped 20 grand because he never had a septic tank pumped in 20 years. It's supposed to be done every three. And that was a $20,000 mistake. And that's what the service fixes. Yes. So the service is simple. We have a homeownership concierge for you. So when you close on the house with us or for some of our past Dude, clients Your as accent well, says that word cool. Concierge is cool with your accent. accent. Most words cool. <laughs> and um, what they're going to do is they're going to go do a 300-point inventory of your home. Not an inspection. Not an inspection. An inventory. Yeah, I keep saying inspection. I said inventory. Right. You said inventory. All right. I'm, just, I'm, I'm just reaffirming. <laughs> so a 300-point inventory of your home. We're get, they're going to take measurements of everything. Like they're going to see how many uh, square footage of cabinets you have in your kitchen. They're going to take the mark, made and model of your appliances. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. um, what else? Uh, they're going to uh, check your HVAC. Mm -hmm. They're going to take uh, pictures of all of your rooms. Everything that is part of your home is going to be there. And then uh, 
you're, you're going to check for recall values? Yeah, I was just going to say, you're going to have a dashboard and your appliances, if there's a recall on any of your appliances, mm -hmm. you're going to be notified, which there was a recall on the electrical box in my house, right, right, right. which, I mean, that's a $2,000 bill that I have to deal with because I have a challenger box and, and think about think about having up, Caitlin? think about having all of this in one single place where if you want to make um, any renovations or if you want to you know you want to paint the house again and all that you have all the measurements you have the make and model of everything you have the exact paint that you're using Absolutely. on your house I mean everything it's right there that's I think that's Man, that's going to save me a lot of money. In it's the a lot. It's really and and again, you know, uh, the beginning of summer, you're going to get you're going to get a reminder like, hey, you should have your HVAC serviced. Um, after you know, after we kind of have fall down here, a fall happens during the winter months. But hey, here's a reminder: you should have your gutters cleaned out. Right. Like I just had um, my house painted, and I don't know how this happened. But one of the gutters in my house was completely caked with dirt, literally rock solid, start top to bottom. So. Look, these maintenance things are there, and you're going to get reminders of that. Um, and again, all the information is going to be there for you in that dashboard. And like he said, if you want to update your kitchen, you click on the kitchen, and all the details you need are there to start getting quotes. And think about this. This stays with the house as well. So if you want to sell the house, the resale value of the house is going to be that much better because this house has a great log of everything that has that you have in this house everything that you've done in this house and he has a full inventory of the house so um you call it house uh, facts. house facts, house kind of facts. Of it's like a surf that you can you can sell it as a certified pre-owned house type look thing. it's it's like having it like how how well would we maintain our cars if we didn't have a check engine light that popped right. up? So this is right. like a check engine light for your home so first part we're going to help you move second part we're going to help you manage and maintain your um your home to keep it in tip top shape maximize resale value and then what well, we're lenders we should probably talk about a financial piece as well yes. right so um the third and final piece of this is a, a real estate wealth management tool and what's going to happen is you're going to have once again in your dashboard you're going to be able to look at everything you need and, and you're going to receive a monthly wealth digest that goes over uh real time updated how much is your home worth okay that value is pulled from uh, a, a whole bunch of different websites and then there's a button on there if you want to request the CMA to fine tune it. Um, it's going to track the ongoing balance of your mortgage and the, the resulting equity position. It's going to go over tips, uh, things you could do to maximize your equity. Like, hey, if you paid an extra $50 a month, what would it save you? An extra $300 and there's a drop down there. Um, it's also going to show you how much money you could make if you were to put this house for rent, uh, for a long-term rent or for an Airbnb, for example. Exactly. And it, I, one part that I think is really cool is, hey, if you rented it out 10 days and you could, you could change all the numbers, 10 days a month, how much could you generate? If you took that money and applied it towards your principal, how quickly would you pay off your mortgage? How much money would you save as a result of that? And look, there's a lot of snowbirds that come here. Absolutely. So that's perfect for people like that. And, and look, we are always talking about how your house is the largest asset and how you can create wealth with your house. But at the end of the day, after you close on that house, very few people understand how to tap into that asset, how to take advantage of the fact that now you have equity on your house. And this is what this is all about. It's about helping you understand how you can maximize the equity that you have in your home, whether it is for buying another house, whether it is to lower your payments, whether it is to make repairs, whatever you want. And the cool thing with that is, as you start building equity and as you, you know, you have a hundred thousand, two hundred thousand, three hundred thousand dollars worth of equity, it also shows you what you can use that equity for. Whether it is for, you know, paying for school or renovating a kitchen Absolutely. or taking that big trip to Europe. Things like that. Absolutely. And the other thing that's really cool about this is you can actually update um, you can actually add additional properties. Okay. Right. And when I added uh, one of my other properties, one of the things that was cool is it did a public record search and pulled in the mortgage from it. Like, hey, it appears that on this date you took out a mortgage for this much at this interest rate, is that correct? And it automatically pulled in the resulting balance with the little button, have you made extra payments? Right. So you could tweak it. And uh, and again, calculated the value of that house. So you, I could flip from property to property to property and really manage my entire real estate portfolio, which 
you know, sometimes when people have a primary home up north and maybe a vacation yeah, home down it's, here, it's tough. Yeah, they don't think of it as a real estate portfolio, but it is. And think about it too. If you're doing that to have the full, going back to the inventory, it's extremely important as well. Yeah. To have that that three hundred point inventory to have everything that you have in the house, it's a lot easier to maintain that rental as well. Uh, it, it certainly is. You know, I just um, I just had to have a little patchwork done in the ceiling of my house. And we need to paint that little spot. And oh my I, God, what kind of white dude, is? It? I, yeah, there's a hundred. There's a thousand of whites. whites. And what brand? Where did we get it 50 from? Fifty shade of white. Yeah, <laughs> I'm climbing around. That's a whole different video. Um, I'm climbing around all over the damn house. Trying, hey, honey, you think it's this one? Do you think it's this one? Right. It it is. It would be so nice to be able to go in and go. Oh, it's the Sherwin Williams. Blah blah blah. You know, paint color code. Blah blah blah. Yeah. And it's there. So, so listen guys, this is something that we are launching. Um, for everybody that's on the contract with us, they will get this. Everybody that uh, obviously from now on get on the contract, there's also a lot of past clients that are gonna receive this. And then finally, this is just an open invitation. If you're watching this and you would like to check out this service, it's absolutely free. DM and us, let us know. We really want as many people to use it because honestly, we want to we want to hear what you think. Yeah, and and look, I can't. Um, we can't open it up to just everybody. So what you know, what we could do, I think, at this point is is we could for the first ten people um, yeah. that wanted that DM us, we could send you the links. Again, there's no cost. There's no nothing. We're just we're just trying to get the service out there. The only thing I ask, if you're not a client and you're you're taking us up on our on our offer, is Please be open to give us back some some feedback with it because yes. um, we want to you know as as any big system like this is is rolled out there's always tweaks and and modifications so the only cost to you is to give us some honest feedback yes, so absolutely for the first ten people that DM us that want to be a part of this if you reside somewhere in the state of Florida reach out to us and uh, we will get the uh, the links over to you to get you set up and if you uh, own a home in the state of Florida yes 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 so uh, look just dude I'm sorry. I I cannot imagine a better value proposition. It's from anybody. It's it's just next level shit. And, and moving like, forward, this is where it's at, man. We're so excited about this that we're doing it in our homes. Of so course, it's it's extremely excited. Um, before we leave, I just think it, we have to touch on what's the happening market, with the man. rates right yeah, now. Yeah, the markets. The um, market's been sweet. We so. <laughs> So the market has been extremely good. We have, um, you know, we've had got, had a, an extremely, you know, good really run. good ride run for the past two months. Yeah. For the past two months, it's been a great run where the market has dropped about 75 basis points, yep. which is, I mean, it's a substantial amount. Even on your actual rate, you actually see the difference about a quarter of a percent or yep. more. So, you know, the rates are extremely low now. What we are looking in the market and, you know, there's always something that's happening, whether it's in the economy or in politics or something that makes the market move quite a bit. Uh, you know, we talked about last year, what we talked about the most was the trade deal in China. Yep. Um, then we had that little scare with Iran. Now the whole thing that's moving the market is the coronavirus. Yeah. What's been very interested until yesterday, really, and it really didn't last it that long, was that the stock market was still going up. Right. The stock market, it's, you know, they haven't turned, you know, that much with the corona, with the scare of the coronavirus. However, the bond market have seemed to have gained a lot of momentum since this scare happened. So yep. we are we are looking at this, we're looking at how this developed, but so far, guys, we have the lowest rates we've had in a long, long time. It's an extremely good time to buy. And um, even though we've talked about the trend we think is going to be to continue to move down very, very slowly, right now, right now, it's it's mostly because of the scare with the coronavirus. Yeah. And, and look, this is why, you know, this is why working with a, uh, a lender that understands these things is, is, nece is necessary because the overwhelming majority of lenders and banks, what they do is you, you apply on this day, they lock your loan, and that's it. Where... We don't do that. We do a detailed analysis of the market. We explain it to the client so they could decide because it's ultimately their choice. Right. If they're risk averse and they like the numbers where they are, let's lock them and nobody has to think about it. But we are consistently locking people at interest rates an eighth, a quarter percent, sometimes more below where, where rates were when we started because we monitored the market, we monitored things, and we were able to take advantages of things and save them 10 bucks a month here and 40 bucks a month there. And look, over time, it adds up. Yeah. So... Um, so anyway, just give us a call if you have any questions. If you're with 
Uh, if you're under contract right now or you're in the middle of a refi and your rate is locked, it really may be worth getting some uh, getting some additional codes because interest rates are better than they were a week or two ago. And, yes. And, and hopefully this continues. So, um, yeah. dude, exciting stuff. Yeah. Keep tuning in. Uh, we're going to miss next week. Yeah. I'm in Cancun, baby. Top producer trip. National top producer. Very exciting. This guy's in Cancun. I don't like Cancun. So, uh, <laughs> but we'll see you in a couple of weeks. All right, guys. Take care. Reach out to us if you have any questions. Bye. Hey, Art.